All right, I just want to say I like this setup right here. All right, so when I get uh, a little tired, if I have to go to the bathroom, I'll, I'll walk over here. It's un they actually keep it unlocked. There's water, there's water down over there. And I can also do a little back workout on this other picnic table right here. When my back gets a little tired, So I'm feeling a little inflammation in my gut. Not sure how it's going to turn. It generally goes worse. I'm going to try different measures, try to stop it. I'm thinking, you know, as, as soon as I hit 40, this stuff started really getting bad. And I'm thinking it probably, this is probably the result of the heavy meat diets that I experimented with for too long. All right, no, UNT Discovery Park, it's really heavily fenced off. Oh, it's 55 on this road, okay. I wonder if the college students have been disbanded. There's a bunch of cars. Big fence for UNT Discovery Park. But uh, with this uh, corona issue, I'm kind of, I'm kind of satisfied with uh, hanging out around here. I just got YouTube red, so I'm gonna just, I'm gonna, I'm going to download videos and and work with that. This is Bonnie Bray? Okay. I'm just going to, you know, I don't need to be connected all the time if I can download. So I subscribe to YouTube Red. And I got two free months. I'll be able to play with it and decide. In one and three quarter miles, turn right on West University Drive. Uh, oh yeah, and now I just look for the, the park turn. I don't know if it'll be so obvious. I want to pay close attention. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna change up my lifestyle in that I'll just, I'll be, I'll download videos and, and watch them elsewhere. I won't, I won't uh, so much Get on. I won't need to get on the internet so much. If I could get fast downloading, I'll download and, and uh, move. See, like this this area, there's only one car parked here. I'm gonna. I guess. I'll, I guess I'll be parking right next to him. Cause uh, now I'm 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 uh, choosing this this popular corner I like. So it looks like the mini Winnie is back. My mini Winnie neighbor. I get to think about all the cool things you can do on there while I sit in here. I'm just making notes at this time. I have a slight ache in the middle burner area. This is the sign that uh, the inflammation will get worse. So I am scared. These medications are always popular to steal. So thunderstorms all night last night into the morning. This car's got a thorough soaking. Let's see how crazy that dashboard gets. So there isn't any casually getting up and going for a walk this morning when I feel like it. This is a little constraining. Alright, so I've been uh, going down with the knife a lot and getting a lot of failures and I'm finding now that I could just go to the take the very tip and go back that's all you need 
whoops and I don't want it I don't want to hit this thing that's an issue too all right all right I cannot say I'm proud of this one whole onion with catfish it's just a mess I burnt the bottom it's a mess I'm not too happy I, I need to I need to cook them separate I just get impatient too All right, onions and fish. Not great, but um, the onions add a sweetness to it. Um, it's not great, but it's okay. It's acceptable for me. Something to eat, something to chew on. So I felt the deep pop on the second set of my back stretching on the picnic table fitness over there. The deep pop, it takes some effort to achieve. So the, this is the last of the ginger I could scrap up out of the Walmart, 12 cents worth. I sincerely hope the grackles make it through this deadly coronavirus outbreak. I would be seriously heartbroken if they were wiped out. Okay, this thing got my attention. It's just a plastic bag. Wow. I was like, what is that? It's like moving and not with the wind so much. So the wind turned the the cart that can't even be seen now is right in front. The wind turned that cart into a missile. It went across the parking lot at full speed. Got in between the, the RV and me. Yeah, the thunderstorms in Texas are pretty, are pretty uh, intense. I didn't expect so much wind to pick up. The lightning is crazy. It's, it's got this strange echo to the lightning, but uh, there were no warnings to like get out of the way of this thunderstorm. Um, it's just really intense, but I guess it's it's not supposed to be deadly. We'll find out. So when I went flying across the parking lot, this is how it ended up. Kind of jumped the curb a little bit. I guess it doesn't look as bad, but. Certainly was a fright to see it just whip by up into that curb. It could have been, it could have hit my car and caused a little bump. Yeah, either the wind or somebody tore down this sign. It's a nice laminated sign. Oh, it's not too strongly taped on. I'm sure they'll find it if the next storm doesn't blow it further away. So check the Wi-Fi connection and it works on the side of the Walmart. Walmart 2.4 towards the back sort of this parking on the side. Nobody parks on the side. I could move from the front if I wanted to have internet while sitting in the car. That's an option. So I'm just I'm just realizing that that's 7 to 8 30 p.m. starts today so they they don't open till 7 th uh, this morning now um, when it used to be it was 6 for a few days I feel like my walking posture is off and that's contributing to my gut it feel my gut is uh, just a it's a little gnawing um, and it just seems like it's a, like something with bad posture that's definitely developing from how I am constantly laying down in that car. So Walmart actually had catfish filet for sale today and they just replenished the chicken. So I mean they're just barely keeping up on things. At least doing good enough for the catfish. I'm thinking I want to toast the musi a little bit and then toss it into the yogurt and let it soak for a while instead of putting it in the yogurt i find i'm just chewing on it now it tastes really good 
when you just I just toasted it a little bit I don't want to overdo it and it tastes a little better nice and now, now that it's just getting cooled down it's got a nice crack uh, warmth crack it's just uh, it's got a better texture to it here's a rare case where Garmin actually gives a more direct route to the library Google Maps is saying I should go down Bonnie Bray to that intersection and down Elm and the, G the Garmin says go down Windsor alright they've closed down if I think about it a little bit I have had training for this corona issue with things closing down during Christmas and New Year's and Thanksgiving holiday seasons when the libraries close for ex slightly extended periods of time not for like two weeks straight but I've gotten a little bit of training for closing closing and I just buckle down and, and sit tight and, and pretty much one spot this is my go-to this is ideal as long as I keep that electricity rolling the bathrooms unlocked there's, very, there's not hardly anybody here people here one other car besides me so I think I could handle it. I think I, I, I'll just focus on exercise and cooking a little bit more. And I just expected to stop here on my way to the library to cook some food. And here I'm pretty much grounded for the next couple of weeks. I can't say uh, this is the worst, uh, the, these are the worst conditions because I have pretty much everything I need with electricity and bathroom and water and privacy. Oh. Unless if he locks the doors, shuts off the electricity. <laughs> See, if, if that guy saw me sitting on my computer he might try to lock, like close the electricity so it's really a risky venture until I get caught now I gotta wait for him to leave it may be in my best interest to wait until after 5 p.m. 5 30 p.m. To wait for uh, them to, to go off shift on the weekdays. Weekends all day would be probably fine, uh, but on the weekdays, then I'll need to uh, be more careful with those guys. So now I gotta double check the doors. He might have locked them. I don't wanna be caught in a, in a sticky situation. He may have. He may have locked the bathroom doors because this is a sports field to encourage gathering. And if you have bathrooms available, that'll really encourage people to gather. I'll check and see if there's bathrooms over here. But I, I believe that it'll probably be in the best interest for the uh, the groundskeepers. Yeah, there he's driving around. I think it might be in the best interest for them to lock the doors. That'll put me in a worse situation, of course. So he just closed the sidewalk gate to drive in, and that was that stayed open. So I'm I am also in a gated uh, parking lot area. I don't think he'll dare close that while I'm in there. At least I'm gonna stay away. He's probably gonna drive over to my car if he hasn't already. I can watch. So they're really shutting down even the parks. They want everybody in their house not in the parks I think this is their office too I don't know why there's two cars here with nobody around it. maybe maybe it's recreational people he didn't drive directly to my car he only closed okay he only closed the, uh, the sidewalk gate um, and that's been open I believe I can't recall completely but I don't think he would have closed the parking lot gate 
he went. I'm sure he circled around this way. Yep, these bathrooms are closed. There were bathrooms here. Yeah, there's a good chance they locked those bathrooms over there now. Dang it. Thursday? 